Brain Trust Digital. I'm a full stack developer obsessed with learning. If you're interested in learning full stack, please subscribe below to receive new content. In this quick tip, we're going to walk through how to add SSH keys to a GitHub account. You typically add these keys as part of your deployment process. You add the keys in GitHub, which allows your server to pull down the private repository during deployment. As a prerequisite, you're going to need a GitHub account. I'm not affiliated with GitHub. This isn't a sponsored video. I just really like their product. While the specific steps may differ on various Git platforms, the general concepts should apply to any version control platform you choose. With that being said, let's get into the quick tip. First, we will navigate to GitHub, um, and then click on the repository that you want to add SSH key to. You're gonna click settings in the right-hand corner, click deploy keys, then add a deploy key in the upper right. Uh, first, you'll give this uh, a title. In this case, we're just gonna call it BTD blog EC2 uh, to represent our server's key. Um, then we're gonna log into the server real quick uh, to actually populate that key. So we're gonna cat out the SSH ID rsa.pub, and you're gonna put just the public key in here into GitHub. So we'll copy that, we'll paste that in the key, click add key. All right, so that key's been added. Now we're gonna end up using this in a follow-up video about deployments, but that's all you need to get the key added. Next, I wanted to show you one more quick tip uh, about GitHub with SSH keys. If you navigate to a user, and you add the .keys extension, you can see all the public keys available for that specific user. Uh, it's just a really nice tip if you need to add somebody uh, to a server, uh, like you have a consultant or a third party uh, that's gonna help you out with a project, you can just add their keys if you know their GitHub username. So if you found this video useful, please remember to like and subscribe. This really helps out the channel. We're a smaller channel just getting going here. Feel free to leave questions or comments or requests in the comment section below, and I'll catch you in the next quick tip.